The bullying that pushed Toshiro Ehara over the edge echoes a previous tragedy. Years before, another boy attempted suicide and remains comatose. Yagami makes his way to Sawa Sensei's apartment, hoping to get some answers that will shed some light on the incident. But, as if by coincidence, he encounters Kuwana instead. What ties could an earnest school teacher and an underground handyman share? Kawana? What the hell are you doing here? You forget to mention you had a connection to Sawa Sensei? Or what? Awkward. Do you or not? And don't pretend you're just here to fix a toilet. Yo! <laughs> <laughs> Now it's RK on top of you? Yagami, we've got more incoming. What is this? These idiots aren't after you. It's me they really want. And I just walked into their trap. What could they possibly want with you? To come all the way from Kamurocho? Akutsu, what is this about? Why do you want her? Looks like they don't feel like talking about it. Get these two fuckers first. <sighs> but try to leave them breathing if you can.
what you got! Sawa-sensei. Yes? 
Don't open your door until the cops get here, okay? I have to go make sure Kuana's all right. But what about you, Yoyo-san? I'm fine. But actually, how do you and Kuana know each other? Sawa-sensei? Fine. Just... Please stay in your room, okay? Hey! The hell you looking at? Not trying to get in our way, are you? Yeah, I am. But I'm in a hurry myself, so I'm not gonna hold back, alright? Yeah? Big words for a little shit! You're nothing without your friend Kaito! Better be ready to get your ass beat. Aren't you the one screwing with me? Besides, I'm not behind any of this. All right, enough of your bullshit. You better say a quick prayer, asshole. Been waiting for you. You a slow runner or something? Uh, they got here before I did. Yagami, sticking your nose in our business again. How about I stick you in an oil barrel and see if you float? That's a halfway decent threat this close to the sea. Ooh, the great detective sounds intimidated. If we make it out of this, I've got some questions that need answering. Sawa sensei won't talk. I wouldn't worry about the future. <laughs> Your life is coming to an end soon. Yagami!
lay down, would you? Huh. Not happening. Good luck, Yagami Kun. Hey, Kawana! Oh, fine. At least you could have done to say thank you. <laughs> we ain't done, Yagami! <sighs> I get you want to play tough, but... Do you ever quit? It's not over till it's over, you little shit. The hell's that? Sawa-sensei! Stop it! Someone's here too? I wouldn't have expected you and this bitch to be connected. What the hell do you think you're doing? This has nothing to do with her. You're the detective, aren't you? You figure it out. Huh? Time's up. Toss his phone before we go any further. His GPS will lead his friends straight to us. Hey, 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 hey. Yagami. Yagami. Rise and shine. shine. There he is. I was starting to worry you might not wake up. My men are glorified amateurs at this stuff. The technique for knocking someone out takes practice to get down. So, uh... Oh good, no brain damage. Man, I'm glad you're tough as nails. Now we can get to the fun part, huh? Yagami-san here just saved your asses. You wouldn't be standing if he didn't come around. There's no way we could have known this asshole would show up. Not my fault everything went to shit. This was your operation anyway. Fine, it's okay. But you need to make sure you keep your boys in check from here on. Huh? <laughs> Did that hurt? <sighs> it hurt, right? See? You all see? First comes pain, and then the fear. You have to start with pain. Fear won't work if you haven't given them a reason. 
Slap them around, but you do need to keep them conscious. Enough to keep the fear alive. That's how you get what you want to hear. Am I right? I can tell when someone's lying. My 